Hotline Miami, the second version in this case, does not output any sound. Before doing anything, we need to make sure that every other game works, so just fire up any random game and check if the sound works. In this case, it was working. So what you need to do to fix Hotline Miami sound is to first understand which sound interface on your computer is being used. Your computer inbuilt sound card, that is onboard audio, is only used when you connect your analog headphones or speakers directly into your motherboard. If you have a monitor with built-in speakers or a headphone out, you are most probably using HDMI or DisplayPort connection to carry both video and audio. In this case, your GPU acts as a sound card and the onboard audio on your motherboard is not used at all. If you use any true USB headset or USB audio interface, they are basically external sound cards and they don't use your PC audio and you can basically disable onboard audio. Anyway, in this particular case, a USB sound card was attached to the computer and used as a main device to play the sound. And you have to make sure that you're adjusting the settings for a correct sound device. So what you need to do is to go to playback devices and select the correct device. In Windows 10, you can reach this list through this menu and in Windows 11, it's a little bit more complicated, but you can still reach it by following this path. So right click on the device you're using to play sounds, go to the properties, select advanced tab, and you will see a default format. This default format is used when your audio device is shared between several applications. For some reason, if this is set too high, Hotline Miami cannot play sound. Since we are using a quality sound interface in this case, it can go up very high. And you will have to select something lower here, for example 24-bit 44 kHz or 24-bit 48 kHz. Keep in mind this is the sampling rate and it does not really affect the frequencies you can hear. Your sound card will still be producing 20 Hz up to 20 kHz despite of what you select here. Anyway, with 24-bit 44 kilohertz or 48 kilohertz sound in hotline miami started to work and i was interested how high you can actually go so the highest setting that still works is 32 bit 352 kilohertz so that's how you fix sound in hotline miami i am the god of youtube like subscribe jingle bells